Hey everyone, today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on self-tanning. Now, I'll be using our Unique's self-tanning lotion and spray. Now, before you tan, you need to make sure that your skin is prepared. So, I'm just doing my legs today to show you how to do it. So, make sure you shave and also exfoliate. Now, you can use um, like sugar scrubs or something like that. But what I like to use is these mitts that you can get from just Kmart for a few bucks. They're um, like a bit abrasive just so it helps get all your dead skin off. Um, so you want to exfoliate your legs and take special care on areas like say your knees where it tends to be drier and more rougher. Just so that you make sure when you tan it's going to go on nice and even. And once you've done that you're ready to move on to tanning. Okay, so I've just got a tiny bit in my hand of our lotion and I'm just going to start in swirling motions and rub it into my skin. And you just want to do sections at a time because this dries quite quickly. don't know if you can see, but already is looking more tanned than it was it's got a really nice smell to it too very easy to put on and put a bit more down here Make sure you do around the back of your legs. Now for my foot, I'm just going to be using our spray. Just hold it up and just do some little sprays. And it's that simple and if you want to do another layer leave it for another just for 10 minutes and then you can go over and do another layer if you're wanting a more darker tan um, once you've finished your layers you need to leave it for five to six hours just to dry before you wash it off so it's five hours later and i've washed the tan off and here we go here's the results this is the one i didn't tan and this is the one i did tan and just so you can see from this angle as well so that's two coats 10 minutes apart just on that leg it's made a huge difference 